learned about public hospitals which are a chain of healthcare centers and hospitals that are run by the government itself. They are linked at the rural and urban setup offering medical services in various fields. They are required to meet the needs of the majority of the citizens in the country. At the village level, they are known as health centers operated by the nurse and village health worker. These medical experts are trained to handle common and simple illnesses in the society. They are not required to offer complex medical conditions like operations and other serious medical conditions. These hospitals are available in a rural and urban setup. We also learned that constitution and courts provide affordable healthcare services to its citizens. In this chapter, we will understand the meaning of private hospitals, their management, ownership, costs, medical practitioners and their efficiency. Many private hospitals are available in the country. The majority of these private hospitals are run by doctors and nurses. These medical practitioners have extended their services to the rural areas and they have opened more healthcare centers to serve the citizens of the country. There are private nursing homes in every part of the country offering quality services. This may vary depending on the demands within the areas. Most of these private medical healthcare centers offer various services including simple ailments, x-ray services, ultrasounds and where patients can buy drugs of their preference or recommendation from their doctors. Charges in these private healthcare centers vary depending on the quality of services offered by them. Charges may also be determined based on the type of ailment that the patient suffers from or the stage at which the disease has reached. Private healthcare centers are owned by individuals but the government. Others are owned by the non-government organizations. The private industry has grown so fast and they are available everywhere. Most of them engage in the manufacturing and selling of medicines to its citizens in a country or abroad. Most of the private healthcare centers are well managed while others are not and that is why you find their licenses are revoked if they don't meet the required standard. Private hospitals are owned by individuals and they are available everywhere. The charges of a private hospital are a bit high. Charges depend on the seriousness of the disease and the quality of services being sought. In this video, we have learned about private hospitals in India and their services. So, who owns private hospitals? What services do private hospitals offer? How private hospitals are managed? In the next video, we will learn about another new chapter. I'll take your leave. Till then, bye. Stay happy.